Yo, so I ain't made a video whilst driving in the longest. So I thought I might as well do one. Right now, where am I? I'm on the A10 between basically Edmonton and Tottenham. And I had a thought come to mind. So I thought, you know what? Let me make this video quickly. So there's certain types of girls that I would never ever date. And you know what? It's not necessarily how they look as well. There's certain types of girls out here. They expect on their first date to be taken to a flashy restaurant. You know, like a, a high-end restaurant like Lockham, Gaucho's, uh, Hakasan or whatever. Not me, fam. Not me. There's certain girl out here. If you ain't taking them to the littest place, they ain't interested. That's cool. I'm not, I don't feel like I need to be taking a girl to a fancy high-end restaurant on the first date. Because for me, if a girl demands a man take her to a flashy high-end restaurant on a first date, that means really and truly, she don't care about going on the date with you. It's not about you, it's more about what she can get from this experience. In my mind, if a girl really likes me, she won't care where the fuck I take her. She won't be bothered. A girl won't care if it's to a bar to get a drink, or a pub, or Tinseltown. If a girl's really interested in a man, it's about him. Yeah? It's about her getting to know him. And vice versa as well. Any man in out here watching this right now, if you're talking to a girl and she's talking about going out or you're, you're talking about going out on a first date first of all don't even ask the girl where she would like to go because first and foremost you're giving her the power yeah? you're, what you're telling the girl if you ask the girl where would you like to go you're basically saying I'm treating you yeah? you are the prize yeah? and it's my job to reward you yeah? your guy watching this right now you're talking to a girl if you want to set a date with a girl you tell her where we're going you tell her the time, the location, whatever. Don't let a girl dictate and tell you where and when. I remember I had one girl before. I never met up, met, met up with her. I never went out with her. Um, now, first of all, a lot of girls jump on on uh, on Tinder and that, and they talk to guys just because they're on a break from their boyfriend. So they basically use guys for their free attention. So I think that's probably what it was. Anyway. Speaking to this girl, nice girl, make sure this girl, green eyes and that, you know. I told her the location and she said to me, oh, um, I, I don't want to go there. I said, why? She said, oh, I don't like the location. I just said to her, let's just go to a pub around the corner um, to get a drink. Now, see, I don't drink alcohol, but I said to her, yeah, this is the place, this is the time, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, can we change the location? Why? I don't like the lo I don't like the area. I said, nah. Responded back to her saying, yeah, boom. It's up to you, yeah? I set the place, time, yeah? If you want to come, you can come. If you don't, you don't, yeah? It's cool. Obviously, as you can imagine, I didn't get out on a date with that girl, innit? and that's fine. If a girl really likes a guy, unless obviously she's read reviews about the place and there was a shooting outside there last time or it's a very antisocial place, then yeah, I could imagine she wouldn't want to go. But I've been to this place before, so there's nothing wrong with this place. It's a calm, casual place. It's not dangerous, it's safe. So there's no reason for the girl to object. Apart from, she don't want to go out with me to meet me and get to know me. Yeah. She just wants to go out for a free date. Or she wants to go out to get her mind off of her, her boyfriend that she's on a break with. No. No, 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 no. I'm not entertaining that. Yeah. So, for me, and that's a good test, you know. At the end of the day, right, we're not going to be able to date and hook up with every girl that we come across. And there's girls out here that are going to use man then for their free attention, use man for free dates. The way to test a girl is to say, yeah, let's just go out to a bar. Yeah. Or maybe just get an ice cream or milkshake, whatever in it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Nothing expensive. And see how she reacts to that. If she doesn't react well to that, then you know it's not about you. Yeah, it's about her. Think about it this way. If Drake hit these gal up, Mayweather. Justin Ross Clark Bieber hit these girls up and said, I'm going to take you to Tinseltown. She will fucking go. 
So yeah, I ain't spending my big money like that on no girl. You know, maybe on a third or fourth date or whatever, if you've hooked up with a girl, then yeah, fine. Spend, if you wanna spend big, then that's up to you. But not on a first date. You know how many men out here I've spent a hundred pound, you know, hundred pound, you know, on a first date to not hear from a girl ever again. That That's not happening to me. I respect my money, I respect my time. There's no way I'm spending them big money there and there's a chance that I might not hear from this girl again. And like, man, if you watch this right now, even girls can relate to this. If a girl really wants to see you, she won't give a damn. I remember a girl, um, I, I met her online and I was, I wasn't busy, I, I was busy or whatever, but I just didn't really want to see her as well, wouldn't it, yeah? And then, you know, she was texting me. She did not, she lived around the corner from my mum's yard as well, actually. I'd never seen her before in my life. She lived there the whole time, but anyway, and I, I know everyone in my area, yeah? So, yeah, I didn't really want to see her, nothing like that. And she begged me, she said, please, you must have one hour in your day to come and see me, yeah, to take me out, like, because she just wanted to see me, like, she was, you know, like, there's some girls, they just see you as a 10 out of 10, and they like you from day one, like, they're, they're after you from day one, and, yeah, she begged me, and she said, please, you must have one hour, and I said, oh, all right, then, all right, you know, you forced me, yeah, you know, what can I say, yeah, you forced me, you put me in a position, you know, where, you know, I'll take you out. And it, and it helps as well if other girls when you're with that girl that likes you if there's other girls rating you as well you know it will serve it will serve you well i remember i went to a shop and some some look up some some girl she weren't nice or nothing like that but she gave me the, the look or whatever and as i've jumped in back in my car i left the girl waiting in my car so i've gone to the shop i see some girls like throwing some signals or whatever and it just ignored them as I've got back into my car, obviously I had the girl waiting there and the girls have walked past and they said, oh, he's got a girlfriend or something like that. So, yeah, you know, them things, they work in your favour as well. But the fact of the matter is, man, them, don't be taking girls out on these expensive dates, man. It's not worth it. If a girl really wants to see you, she won't care where you take her. She will not care where you take her. As long as the place is safe and it's clean inside or whatever, it won't matter. If you feel like you need to um, take girls to all these expensive restaurants, you, you, you're basically trying to impress them with your money. You're trying to lead with your wallet. You're trying to lead with your success. You don't want to get girls just because you drive a flashy car. You don't want to get girls just because you've got a, a, a property or you earn this amount of money from work. You, know, you want girls to like you for you. So, yeah, success is attractive. Success is att attractive to women, yeah. But it's not the be on end all. I know girls, young, impressionable girls as well, you know. Like, there's girls that I know when they all, they told me that when they were 16, man are pulling up in Rolls Royces, you know, to take them out on dates and she's never seen them again. So, so you've gone out of your way to, to, to rent out or whatever, innit? Acquire a Rolls Royce somehow to take out a girl on a date to not see the girl ever again. Like, what a waste of time, what a waste of effort. And if you are, if you do have a Rolls Royce, why are you dating some little hood girls anyway? Cause this girl I know is a hood thing. So like, if you got that caliber of money and you're that successful, why are you not dating a girl or even potentially going out on dates with girls that are of a certain caliber? Like a girl with a fucking job, at least, yeah? Yeah, it's not about dating lawyers and that, but fucking hell, date a girl that has a job, yeah? So, or well, date a girl that's fucking old enough to have a job, the girls, 16 at the time like you're why, why are you trying to even link a girl yeah you drive a Rolls Royce that means you're of a certain age why are you, yeah so yeah don't leave with your wallet I know a girl out here they told me that oh yeah on the first date the guy is taking some restaurant and he spent like a hundred pound and that and you know when she's jumped in the car after he's picked her up Somehow he had to bring up the fact that the car cost 50 grand and he paid for it in cash So you're leading with your wallet Yeah The girl should not like you because what you have to offer her in terms of monetary value Yeah The girl should like a man because of the way he makes her feel Yeah Just that swag, that energy, that aura, that charisma You know, makes her feel safe which is attractive to a woman Yeah See, man in my head, don't leave with your wallet now I'm on the road now and the camera's shaking too much so I'm going to end the thing. Yeah, but yeah, there's a certain girl out here, 
I will never be dating because if a girl thinks to herself, yeah, he needs to take me out to Lokom and Hakkasan and Gauchos and all these rich, posh people places, that's not. Yeah. Yeah. Stay away as people.